welcome back to Mama Z's Texas Kitchen. So this week I wanted to talk about canning corn. Um, I don't have a very big freezer. In fact, the only freezer I have is the side by side on my refrigerator. We live in an apartment, so I don't have a deep freeze and I don't like necessarily using canned vegetables. I prefer, much prefer canning my own vegetables. So what do you do if you um, want to have preserved uh, vegetables, but you don't want to have, um, you know, if I had a choice, I'd prefer having either my own canned vegetables or having frozen vegetables. So I went to our local store. This is the HEB brand. Um, corn and if you read the ingredients the only ingredient in here is corn they don't add anything to it no preservatives um, it's just corn and I'm going to show you how you can can your own corn so I'm going to tilt the camera down and we're I'm going to show you it's very simple if you have a pressure cooker um, the cooker uh, pressure cooker I use is um, it is an electric canner it has a canning setting on it it is not an instapot i feel like i need to give that a uh, disclaimer every time i do a canning video uh, it is not an instapot it is a pressure canner so anyway i'm going to tilt the camera down and then i'm going to show you how we do this okay so i'm just going to dump this frozen corn out into a bag now i'm just using the ball um, recipe in the ball book. Now, honestly, you could take the time to um, uh, take the corn off the cob and all that stuff. Um, I frankly don't want to do that. I don't have the time or energy to sit there and do that. Um, way too much time and energy that, that I don't have right now. So I, I've already done this once, it worked perfectly, and you can too. So I'm gonna take my funnel and just take a cup. I'm using 18, uh, I'm using 12 ounce jars here. And I'm just gonna fill it, leave about an inch of head space. And these jars, these are clean, sterilized jars. Um, and I'm also using some eight ounce jars. We're not a really big family. There's just three of us here in the household. So you honestly could, I've made some pint jars up as well. You could use the bigger pint jars, but we don't eat that much uh, corn at once. So I make the smaller jars. A lot of times it's just me and Kendra that will eat the corn anyway. Though, when I made it for my watch on the plate with Mama Z, um, Keith Roy really locked it, so. I may have enough for one more small jar in here. And then what you're going to do is you're going to take some boiling water. Now I've got over here on the stove. We're going to have to do up some more water. Okay. 
and you're gonna pour it over the top of your corn. And I did let my corn sit out and come to room temp. It's not frozen right now, so. going to go along the sides and get all your air bubbles out. Um, just a little side note, I picked these up at the Dollar General today. Our local grocery store was out of the ball lids. I have used these before, guys. They work just as well, and they were cheaper, and they had a ton of them. So if you're having a hard time finding lids, um, check out Dollar General. to wipe off your lids or your rims. This is a good time, guys, to be putting up everything you can. No, this doesn't come right out of your garden right now, but you need to be storing up. And then put your uh, Finger tight. I'm going to get my canner out and we'll be right back. Okay. So you're just going to set it in here. Get me some water. There's some water on the stove. Fill it up to a quarter of the way up 
the bottom of the jars. Okay, let me see more. I need more than that. Okay. Lid on, put it in the lock, hit canner, put time. All right. And then you just let it go from there. For an hour. For an hour. I'm depressurizing it, or rather she did. So. Wait, Wait for our red button to go down. This is why I don't get on camera because I don't talk. So everybody's going to have to deal with that when we wait for this to come down the pressure. Pressing down on me. No pressure. Talking crap to the camera. No, it's deep pressurized. I'm just sitting here. I got time. Yep, you're gonna have a big gag reel. Oh lord. Okay, so it has depressurized. That hurt. Okay. Now it has depressurized. We're going to take the lid off. Sit it over here. And we have corn. Look at that, guys. And this is better than anything you will get out of a, a can of corn that you buy in the store. Doesn't have any chemicals, no salt, no nothing. Now, if you wanted to add a little bit of salt to the can, you can. But I prefer, honestly, not to, because you can season it up when you open it up, put butter on it, whatever you want to do. Yo guys, it is that easy. All right, so that is your first video this week. Thank you for joining me. Be sure and like, subscribe. I am pushing for a thousand guys. Thank you so much for joining me. See you on the next video. Meant to be.